Hello everyone, welcome back to Greyfellow's channel, Far Cry 5. We just wrapped up some co-op here, and, well... May not look like much now, but I know we can rebuild it into the beautiful lodge it once was. Go away. And I'm just picking up from where I left off. I've seen what they do with the people they capture. They fucking feed them to those judges. It's about time someone heads into the Fang Center and takes them all out. Are you with me? Why not? That's far away. This is Wade over at the Fang Center. Peggy's took all the animals, but I think Cheeseburger is still loose. Ha. <laughs> well, that's cool. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna head back over here, get a helicopter, and then we'll fly up there. I'll see y'all then later. Alright. I was brought here under false pretenses and fed lies about her deceiving family. Foolishly, I believe her. But now, after this great generosity, I know the truth. So that's gone. I swear, how can y'all see me up here? That means... Come over here. Alright. And now, we snipe to our heart's content. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Whatever, I'll take no alarms. That is, that's bullshit. I'm using a 50 caliber rifle. This should kill every human in one shot. Oh my gosh, the weapon switching in this game.
Cool. Great work, Deputy. The cult won't be training judges at the Fang Center anymore. Good lesson for them, too. Fuck with us, we fuck with you right back. The Fowler brothers will be real pleased to get their place back. See if they need any help with the cleanup, would you? And there might be still some scared or hurt animals about. Thanks for getting us the Fang Center back, even if there ain't no animals left. I'm just glad to see it out of the cult's hands, training those wolves to cause hell. And they've been shipping those crazy wolves all the way to the old lumber mill. Keep an eye on prisoners. Now, we had a bear here named Cheeseburger. Bit of a local celebrity, actually. Had a soft spot for Chad's barbecue. But he got the diabetes, so we put him on a liquid salmon diet. <laughs> Anywho, Cult tried to take him, so I set him free. Last I heard, he was causing all sorts of mayhem. Someone should go find him. Make sure he's all right. Grab some salmon from the pond ahead of time, though. Then feed Cheeseburger that salmon, and he'll be eating out of the palm of your hand. All right, you got this. Why not? First, I gotta restock. Give me your ammo. The Peggy's all riled up. Let's start fishing. Alright, cheeseburger. Where are you? Oh. Will you crouch? Oh. Oh, can I get all three? It's like a doggo, but better. Take him to that bear for the reaping. No. No, this is my bear. What is your problem? This is my bear.
<laughs> Screw you guys, this is my bear. Oh, thank you. See, he is like a doggo, but better. No. God damn! I heard you found cheeseburger. As long as he's with you, I know he's safe. Just remember, don't actually feed him cheeseburgers, because you know he's got the diabetes. <laughs> I am legit legitimately not scared with cheeseburger around. Hunters. It don't sound too good. If Jacob wants you, he's gonna send his best out after you. Watch your back, deputy. Oh boy. Switch. Oh no! Who's a good bear? <laughs> what? to the powerful and then we are shocked to find ourselves adrift but history knows the value of sacrifice of culling the herd so that it stays strong over and over the lives of the many have outweighed the lives of the few this is how we survived and we've forgotten and now the bill has come due now, the collapse is upon us, and this time the lives of the few outweigh the lives of the many. And when a nation that's never known hunger or desperation descends into madness, we'll be ready. We will call the herd. We will do what needs to be done.
good. Call the herd. Keep moving. Sacrifice the weak. Walker, go to the truck. Yes, sir. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry. Give me a hand, kid. <laughs> Eli, is this? Yep. What the fuck is the deputy doing here? Jacob took a shine to him, same as us. You're gonna be okay, hero. Whitetail's got you now. <laughs> We're bringing him back to the wolf's den? Where else? Tammy's not gonna like this. Don't worry about Tammy. She'll be fine. out of your fucking mind? Now, hold on. Weedy and I agreed. Oh, you agreed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I was the best and impartial observer. This is stupid. And this is dangerous. You both know better. What was I supposed to do? Leave him to die. Tammy. They've been in that room for God knows how long. I've seen what it does to people. You haven't. You can't trust this one. That's what everyone said about you. But luckily, I didn't listen. This is not up for discussion. We need him. That's all there is to it. Understand? You're right. She took that real well. Doubt. I didn't even do anything. I'm not what I said. We need you. Let's get you some rest. What's up? Whoa, 
you're awake. Eli wants a quick word with you. Four black screens in as many minutes. Yeah. That is some primo ubi storytelling right there. Doesn't explain anything or otherwise advance the plot. <laughs> you're looking better now. Go, go see Eli. He needs you. I'm better than guard duty. Back from the dead. There you are. Been trying to track you down, deputy. Dutch speaks highly. Look, I'll get right to it. I know what you did down south. You got the father thinking twice now, and that's good for us. We're bleeding bodies up here. No two ways about it. I don't know if we'll be able to hold out more than a week at this rate. Times are desperate, to say the least. I'm trying to get some footholds back, so I sent a handful of whitetails out to sabotage the visitor center. The cult's been using it as a depot for that bliss shit. But our guys walked right into a fucking trap. They've been taken hostage, and we're up against the clock. If I just send another group in there, we risk losing everything. But you, you're something that cult ain't expecting. You're the only one I got around here who can handle this, Step. Only one I trust to handle this. I'm counting on you. You'll need to go in quiet. Cult gets windier around, they're liable to kill our people. There's a bow on the table if you need it. Get our people back, Deb. Good luck. Nothing to do with the Southern interest. It's Corey, by the way. Uh, I'm seeing a possible roadblock near the Southern interest. Never. It's Corey, by the way. Uh, I'm seeing a possible roadblock near the Southern interest. Good to have you on it's our Corey, side, Deb. I see you're feeling better. Might have come across a little harsh earlier. I ain't apologizing. I'm just acknowledging. I don't trust people I don't know. But Eli says you're all right, so I gotta go with that until I see otherwise. You prove your worth, and you and I will get along just fine. Here's the deal. Weedy's trying to get a pirate radio station up and running. He told Eli it's to help coordinate the militia, but I'm pretty sure he just wants to play his own music. So we're gonna indulge him. Problem is, he can't get a signal out. Our friend here said the cult's been jamming this whole area. Also told us how. Seems there's two radio towers with jammers on them and a third on a mobile unit patrolling the roads. Take the towers out first. That ought to clear the signal enough for me to locate the patrol. I'll let you know when I find it. Do this, and maybe we can start building some of that trust up. Yeah, okay. You're gonna help us take this mountain back. Could use your help. We're low on manpower. All right, one more and then we'll call it. Whitetail Militia's been ready for this fight for years. Eli made sure we had caches stashed all over the place. Guns, ammo, you name it. Gotta be prepared for anything, you know? But the way things are going, we need those supplies here. Not sitting in some bunker waiting to be found. Last thing we need are the fucking Peggy stumbling across our shit. So if you could get those supplies, it'd be a big help for us. But, uh, there is one problem. We don't keep a map of the caches here. Don't ask me why. Safeguards, or some bullshit. There's a scout up at the Jefferson Lookout Tower who should have one. Place is just west of here. Good luck, and be careful out there. Bow hunt. Run out of bullets. You can rely on a good blade. You used to stay up half the night party. 
Mercy. The possible roadblock now, near the southern entrance. It's Corey, by the way. Uh, Good to have you on our side. Yeah. <laughs> the southern entrance. It's Corey, by the way. Uh, I'm seeing a Where was that ladder? There it is. Off the fire. Watch out for wildcats on nights like this. So you've met Eli. You're in good hands now. He'll get you squared away with anything they need up there in the mountains. I'll still keep an eye on you though. Talk soon, kid. Alright. Yet another unintentional story mission and a couple of other things. So yeah, I think we'll call it good. Thanks for your time. Drop a like if you liked it. Tell me in the comments if you didn't. And I hope to see you all next time.